Hello lovely people. Today I'm doing an unboxing of a calming canvas designs. Diamond painting. I'm so excited. Uh, this definitely took a while to get here. I think they are in the UK and I am in the US. So yeah, let's open this baby up. Okay, before we open it up all the way, I wanted to show you guys, so I already showed you this. Calming Canvas Designs, Crafting Serenity One Diamond at a Time. That's their little logo. And then I do like that they do this. Sorry, I bumped you. Yeah. Not a lot of canvases do this, sorry. <laughs> it's kind of hard at the angle that I'm on. I'm not filming in my normal spot, but um, this is the, I have to look it up. I, I did get it with two ABs. You can, when you get on there, choose ABs or crystals. And I chose ABs. Yeah, it's quite a bit more expensive than other diamond painting companies to choose ABs, but yeah, we'll open up and talk about it. All right, here we are. Um, I did want to point out how nice it was that the box was not like completely destroyed because I feel like I've been getting a lot that are... Oh, there's something in here. Okay, so it comes with its washi tape. That's cool. Uh, I think the only other one that I've gotten washi tape with, do I need to zoom in, is... Uh, Ever moment. Okay, so here is the kit. Comes with a bunch of bags. Also, like Ever Moment, it comes with these bags that have like an opaque front to them, so it's easier for writing on, easier to see, and with plenty of them too. There's a the, look, look, it's hefty. <laughs> so it comes with these two heart wraps. This is interesting. I've never seen this orange wax before. I don't know if that's showing up on camera, but it's very orange. Um, so that's cool. Orange wax. My kids will go crazy over that. Oh, it comes with a cover minder too. Look how cute that one is. That might be my new favorite little strawberry cover minder. Oh, as I drop it. Okay, these are really good tweezers. Ouch. <laughs> Just pinched myself with them. <laughs> really good tweezers. It comes with a two placer, a pen, a single placer. Um, I mean, these aren't like the nicest plastic ones, but but that's maybe like a six placer, seven placer maybe. And I've always loved when they, they come with these because I actually use these a lot lately. And just a regular boat, um, which are, you know, whatever. I don't use those. I need to figure out what to do with all of them because I don't want to just throw them away. All the ones that have come with all my kids. But I don't know what else to do with them. Okay, so. Okay, it's so similar to Ever Moment. Oh, this is longer than I thought it was going to be. Okay. It comes with also these release papers, which I really appreciate. Yeah, they're big, but you can always cut them smaller. Obviously, it's not enough to cover the whole canvas, but you can cut some of the plastic off and then uh, put these down and then cut more plastic off. Yeah, anyway. Oh, I love when they're actual stickers. That makes such a huge difference. It's not like maybe the nicest. It's it's kind of like I'm worried that would actually bend easily. But anyway, so this is the picture. It comes with 54 colors. And two of those are ABs. I'm trying to see where those ABs are. Hmm. It doesn't say which ones are the ABs. But I guess we'll see here in a second. Some of those symbols are strange. Like this one right there. I've never seen that before. Is that a 7 or like a weird symbol some of these like that one's strange anyway some of these symbols are strange i don't know how i feel about those symbols but um as far as like kits go it's really really nice and okay here are yep i was thinking there i like how it comes with bag one of two and bag two of two and it shows you right here which canvas this is honestly you could probably put on their the name of the piece, which is Mauve Easter Bonnet Bunny. You can just write it there and then it's in there. And you can see an AB right away. That's a lot of ABs. I'm glad because it was a lot more expensive to get the ABs. Should we look at the drills really fast first? One second, I'm going to, oh my gosh. I keep bumping you guys. It's a new spot. I'm trying to navigate around it. All right, let's do a, hold on. I'm gonna roll this up and get it flattened. 
All right, that flattened out so nicely. Um, let's look at those drills before we show the canvas. So much of this reminds me of Ever Moment, down to the feel of the canvas. Canvas is, it's not as thick as Diamond Art Club, um, but it's incredibly soft. I think it's similar, it reminds me of Dreamer Designs. This is one of the nicest feeling canvases that I've gotten out of any of the companies, for sure. And it has the perforated edges and the scalloped edges, and that's always very, very, very appreciated. So let's check out some of these colors. Wow, look at that pink. Three of these. Let me see which ones the ABs are in a little bit. I do not like those tiny bags. I'm glad not all of this is. But I did figure out a trick with the small bags like that. You break, cut them or fold them like this, then cut them and then pour them all in at once. <laughs> it's a little precarious, but it, it works. Okay, I wonder what that two down there means in this three. Ooh. Three, two. Yeah, oh, it's saying how many bags of them? No, because there's only one there. Four. I don't know what that means, the fours down there. Three. It's funny that these have big bags. This says A. One. <laughs> Four. I don't know what that means. Oh well, probably just doesn't matter. It'll just bother me. Okay, so none of the ABs in this pack. I'm going to pause it. All right, second bag of drills. So a lot of everything I was expecting, a lot of really neutral Easter tones, which I I love it. It's, it's kind of a nice change from the kits that I have been doing, which right now I'm working on Satura. I've been working on that for a long time, for those of you who might be returning. That's not very many 310s, probably for the eyes. And then uh, Valentine's Kitty, which is really bright pinks and pastel -y, which is beautiful. I love it. So I like that this is a little bit more of a muted color palette, just for a change, because I'm always up for changes. A few bags of those 929. Just going over these quickly. That is such a pretty blue. Yeah, such a pretty red too. It's probably going in the flowers or the ears. Anyway, so this is different. I've also been working on the paint gem set florals so that's like a lot of greens and reds and pinks and just floral tones some browns oh look at this chocolatey brown that's gorgeous we just watched Willy Wonka at the theater for my daughter's birthday and uh oh man talk about a movie making you want chocolate Okay, so here are the two ABs. There's a little bag of these white ones. Um, and a big bag of these brown ones. More like a taupe color rather than brown. I like the purple that's in there. That's really pretty. And I'm curious to see where that is. So I'm going to pack these away besides the ABs and we're gonna check it all out. Okay, ready for this reveal? It'll probably be sideways. That was a little bit of a flop. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. You know what? More and more, this reminds me of Ever Moment. Besides like the, everything does. Cause also I noticed this when I was straightening this out. 
This plastic is so thick. It's the thickest I've seen, except for Ever Moment. Ever Moment's this thick too. It's just so thick, which I absolutely love having a thick plastic. It was made it so much easier to, it was so fast to straighten this. I just pulled it out and, and it all went down straight. And same for the other side. Um, it's so soft. It, this reminds me so much of Ever Moment. So, uh, yeah. Even down to the way that it has this kind of negative image sort of look to this part. Because, I mean, when you look at the drills, you know that this is not the coloration that this rabbit is going to be. It's going to look like the colors that we just looked at, which does not reflect what it looks like right now. It's going to be looking like this picture, right? Because I see those colors in it. So I think that's really cool. That makes it fun. It makes it almost kind of like a mystery diamond painting. If you guys don't know what that is, it's where they have it in black and white and you put the drills down, but you don't really know what the image is until the drills are down. And so I really like that. I mean, you obviously can tell what the image is, but it's a little bit in the mystery kit of the mystery kit in which the painting itself before the drills are, is going to look different than how the drills look on it, which is true for all diamond paintings, but especially when it has a negative image sort of thing like this or every moment or from what I hear, Jada Gem Shop is very similar. And... It makes it kind of have that feel of, oh, you finish this one square? Well, it's like vibrant and perfect, and it, it builds as it goes. I don't know how else to explain it. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's check a look. Um, check a look. Take a look at these ABs. Actually, before we do that really fast, I think I said the name before, but right here it has Mauve Easter Bonnet Bunny. I do want to point out this is Legally Licensed Company. Um, this is Digital Magpie Design Studio is the name of that artist. And uh, here's the calming canvas designs. I do want to point out that I am an affiliate and if you go down, although at the time of this video you can get 40% off on site and I believe you can add my 10% discount top on top of that. If you click the link that I'll have down below in the description and then get whatever you want in your cart and then add Courtney Lyons into the coupon code spot, right? If you add Courtney Lyons in there, I think it gets you an extra 10% off of that. Uh, I'm not entirely sure on that, but I'm pretty sure, so don't quote me on it, but <laughs> might as well try it out, right? And uh, I just wanna point out, as far as first impressions goes, this is my, this Dreamer Designs and Ever Moment, which are right there below, just below Diamond Art Club, because I absolutely love Diamond Art Club. Um, I do love trying out these smaller companies, but Diamond Art Club, I think most of you agree, it just quality-wise is so good. And Dreamer Designs would be next under that of things that I've tried. Um, I have yet to put any drills down yet on the, my Dreamer Designs canvas that I have kitted up, but I will be doing that soon. But yeah, this one will be started here soon too because I'd love to have this ready for Easter. And I would say next in line for what seems like really good quality diamonds. I mean, you could see those. They really didn't seem to have any issues. Uh, quality diamonds and quality canvas, quality plastic, everything about it, it feels so quality. And that would be Ever Moment as well. Both of those, which would come right underneath Dreamer Designs on first impression of things that I've tried. So, um, yeah, this one will be kitted up sooner rather than later, probably in March uh to get started on this so let's check out where those ab's go so let's start with the white ones it's 5200 which is oh it does say the ab's at the bottom just not on the stickers 5200. it's just the last two it doesn't say ab but it is the last two right here the 3866 so you're gonna be looking for those j's and it's just, i've just never seen some of these symbols before that little person symbol so, and you can see it right here. Oh, okay, so not the J's, but this symbol right there. Okay, but still the person symbol for that white one. So let's look for that. There's not, I mean, it's a bag. It's, 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 a, it's an okay bag of it, not a ton. You're gonna see that all along the rim of her hat right here. Also, how cute is she? She's so cute. It just makes me think of Watership Down or, I don't know, like, 
any of these like animal kid woodland woodland animal kid books I used to read as I was younger so I that's what it makes me think of and reminds me of so you're gonna see a lot of the ABs in here uh, down here for these white ABs anywhere you see these lighter patches you're gonna have some ABs interspersed throughout <clears throat> excuse me is my voice a bit so yeah that's pretty cool let's see let's look at these are the brown ABs right here or more like a taupe there's a little bit of trash right there but you oh I forgot I did forget to say these are resin drills maybe I did say that so and which I really appreciate I love those a lot more than I do acrylic drills it has such a different feel to them uh, I think it gets funny <sighs> But instead of another bag like this, which these would fit into, they did three little bags. I don't know why, but whatever. They'd probably do it based off of weight. And anyway, so that is going to be this. Ooh, that's going to be confusing. Looking at drill uh, at symbols that might be confusing. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So the AB drills. I don't know if you can see that. I keep bumping you guys. Are these like four squares made into a square? Kind of like a Rubik's Cube kind of look. But then there's also this right here. Where it's these three triangles into a triangle. <laughs> and maybe that wouldn't bother anybody else. But that is totally going to get me. Yeah, that's totally going to get me. Especially since they're both like that taupe tan color. And they're right next to each other. That's a bummer. But that's okay. Um, Let's see. Any other of these? So you're going to see them... All along, the, the, these ABs kind of are everywhere. They're anywhere you see this darker brown outer lining along here. So that's kind of cool. Um, yeah, up here in the hat too. Anywhere you see this dark brown, not up there. So not really in her ears. Mostly down here in her face, down here. All along here. Any of the, Any of these like darker outlinings you're going to have the ABs. So that'll be interesting. Um, it's kind of cool. It's gonna add a little bit of a glitter sparkle but without being like a full patch of ABs, which I think with this one would work really well for that darker color. For the lighter color, I think it does look pretty to have kind of the patches of the white. So, should be cool. I'm excited to try this one. I will be keeping it out because I want to work on it for uh, Easter time coming up, so that'll be pretty cool. Um, okay, so pros and cons. And cons, some of these symbols are strange. Um, symbol clarity, let me see if I can bring, I mean, you kind of saw it earlier. Symbol clarity is really good. I don't see any like smudging or anything like that, so. Symbol clarity is good. Symbol confusion. Symbols, some of those look confusing and some of them are kind of just weird symbols. I don't know how to feel about some of them, especially all these like Japanese looking symbols. I'm sorry if it's actually different, like Chinese or Korean or something like that. They're all very similar to me in my mind. So I, I don't, that, that's kind of hard for me. Um, another con is that this, I did forget to say, it's pretty confetti heavy besides a few patches of, you know, some color blocking. I don't know if they hand render everything or not, but, um, that's a maybe con because some people like confetti. Like, I don't mind confetti. I like it, uh, to, to a point. And I think it looks like a, a fairly good balance, maybe leaning towards confetti heavier on the confetti so i'm trying to get these bubbles out i don't think of any other cons and guys i didn't even try the glue okay pretty sticky i'd say moderately sticky i felt stickier but i've also felt less sticky <laughs> yeah moderately sticky um yeah okay so that's all for the cons i think well actually i would say all these tiny little bags might be that's nitpicking on the cons because I hate kidding up with those, honestly, but also not a huge deal. Not the end of the world. Not actually going to bother me once I'm done kidding up, you know? So, uh, let's work on pros now, though. 
uh, Reds and Diamonds, which is a huge pro in my mind. They look like pretty good quality. I did forget to say a con was that that if you want to add ABs or crystals, it's actually quite a bit more of an expense. So maybe if you don't like ABs or crystals or S specials or anything on it, then maybe you're like, oh, this is great because it's fairly good, like really good priced canvases and shipping is not very expensive. So, but if you do like adding, you know, the bling to it, eh, you might be better off making your own bling to it if you have extra drills or specials um, just because of the pricing. But um, they were pretty generous with the ABs, so there's that. All right, so more pros because I had to go back and tell that con that I'd forgotten that it is a very soft canvas. It definitely flattens out very easily. It has the perforated edges and the scalloped edges, which I always think makes a huge difference. It always makes it look so much prettier. Um, it definitely goes out of its way with adding the kit, with having the cover minder, the release paper, the washi tape. Um, it does have the nice tweezers and Another thing that's a pro, back to the stickers, and I already said this, but it does have the actual stickers, you know, they're stickers, which makes kitting up a lot easier. Um, I did forget to say a con was that it did take a long time to get here, like weeks and weeks. I, I think I want to say I got this back in December. So it's been a while, which... I had plenty to work on in the meantime, so really it doesn't bother me. Another pro, sorry, I thought I was gonna do cons first and then pros. Mm, I'm just all over the place. But this plastic is really, really thick, which I really appreciate. That, um, yeah, I think that's it, guys. Uh, it's beautiful. I'm really excited to work on this one. So, Yep, look forward to that one. This will be one that, even though I'm unboxing now, it will be one I soon work on. So look forward to that. And thanks for joining me, guys. Bye.